And right now, West Point Military Academy is using the holiday break to remove several Confederate monuments. Xavier Walton joins us live with more on the process and what will be removed from this historic school. Good morning, Xavier. Kelly, good morning. And this really is just the first stage over the next year. West uh, or West Point is going to remove or modify more than a dozen symbols that have some sort of tie uh, to the Confederacy. And that includes uh, taking down a portrait of General Robert E. Lee that is still up in there, up in the Academy's library. Uh, it's part of a directive coming down from the Department of Defense. Uh, this process, it started, like you mentioned, over the holiday break. And according to the Academy Superintendent, Lieutenant General Stephen Gilland, uh, so two months later, here we are. The Academy has begun by removing uh, the portrait of Lee as well as stone bust, a stone bust of Lee. And, and you know, the Academy is also going to remove three bronze plaques uh, that include Lee and other Confederate figures, um, which include an image of a hooded figure uh, with the words Ku Klux Klan written below. Uh, Lieutenant General Gilland, this is the superintendent of the Academy, said, quote, uh, we will conduct these actions with dignity and respect. Now, since May of 2020, at least 230 symbols of the Confederacy have been removed or renamed uh, across the country. That's according to the Southern Poverty Law Center. Just last week in Richmond, Virginia, that's the video you're looking at. Workers removed the bronze statue of General Ambrose Power Hill, a Confederate general killed in the American Civil War. Um, this was the city's last standing Confederate monument. Um, but back to West Point's effort, it speaks to the bigger picture here. Uh, the last part of the process is changing street names, buildings, uh, and areas with names all tied to the Confederacy. Uh, the Academy, uh, as that directive from the Department of Defense, has until next December, so December of 2023, uh, to do all of this, Kelly. All right. I know you'll stay on top of that. All right, Xavier, thank you. Thank you for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.